everyone welcome to js cafe and in this video we are going to solve the problem minimum insertions and deletions to transform a string into another so without wasting any time let's get started so uh, this question uh, is a, a variant of a longest common subsequence which we solved in the previous video if you haven't seen uh, this question longest common subsequence then do check out the previous video uh, links are in the description so uh, in this question minimum insertion and deletions you have to do, what you have to do is you will be given two strings again str1 str2 and you have to convert string one into string two and for that you need you are having two operations you can uh, delete uh, characters from this string and you can uh, insert characters uh, in the places okay so we can see that uh, for hometown to be converted to o m k w n you have to remove h you have to keep this as it is you have to keep m as it is you are uh, you are having e so you basically you have to remove this e and in place of this e you have to put a k then you have a t over here and you have a w so you have to remove a t from this you here comes a o you have to remove the o and w n you are keeping as it is so this is how you will co convert this string str1 to str2 with insertion and deletion or uh, operations so how come longest common subsequence comes into the play so see the thing is you have to convert str1 and str into str2 okay so wouldn't this make sense if you are able to find that what was the common the length of the common subsequence between these two because let's say if i was knowing that there are x number of characters that are common subsequence between str and str str1 str2 so i don't need to make any efforts to add uh, these characters in str1 because they are already present in str1 what i need to do is i just need to figure out how many out of uh, the remaining remaining means the uh, subtracting all the common subsequence from str1 just having str2 okay so whatever is left after subtracting uh, a common subsequence from str1 that many characters we don't need okay so i'll show you i'll show you by the example okay so what we have done is first we ran a common subsequence and we find the length of the common subsequence over here which is 4 we have length 4 of a common subsequence so we have h o e t o w n and i have to convert this into o m k w n okay the length of this whole string is 5 and the length of whole this whole string is 8 and the common lcs is four over here now here comes the tricky part so i know that out of these eight characters four are common right four are already common which means that eight minus four which which will give us four these many characters i have to delete right makes making sense suppose in this o m k w n w n n o m w n is matching already it is already there in str2 so i just need to get rid of h over here get rid of e over here get rid of t over here and get rid of o over here i delete this so subtracting else uh, n1 let's call 8 as n1 and this is lcs length so n1 minus lcs this is nothing but n1 minus lcs this gives us deletions right 
this is giving us the number of deletions that we have to do now comes a part then how many do we have to insert right so let's have a look at the string 2 string 2 is having a length of 5 let's call it n2 take care out of this out of this 5 4 are already present in str1 which means that we have to convert str1 into str2 okay and in str2 we have four uh, four things already present in str1 now what are the characters that are not that we need to insert in str2 obviously that would be the characters that are the characters that are not in the common subsequence right in in this str2 o m w and n o m w n are already present which is not present in str1 this k so we have to add a k in this str1 so what is the length of uh, how many insertion operations you have to do you have to do 5 minus 4 5 is the length of this str2 and 4 is the lcs length over here which gives us 1 so we have to do one insert operation in str1 so n2 minus lcs gives us insertions right making sense let's run this again if you are have if you are having any confusion so in str1 the length is 8 and the str2 the length is 5 okay and our lcs longest common subsequence between str1 and str2 was 4 means there were four common uh, characters subsequence okay in a subsequence i mean we, they can be skipped but they are continuous okay so we found that okay 4 is the length of subsequence which means in str1 we have four characters that is already uh, there in str1 and we don't need to remove them okay so what we need to remove then if there are four characters that we don't need to remove and the total length is 8 then total length minus LC, uh, these many characters common characters will be the amount of deletions which we get to do okay so this is the length of the str1 this is the lcs and subtracting this will give us the deletions or the non-common uh, characters in the subsequence and they we want to get rid of them okay so we got rid of h e t n o great now we got rid of the characters but we also have to insert it in order to match okay we saw that in the str2 there are the length is 5 and our lcs is 4 eventually str1 has to become str2 but what is missing in str1 what is missing in str1 that is present in str2 which is k so how we will get k k is nothing but basically uh, subtracting lcs from the length of this string 5 minus 4 gives 1 5 is the length of this string and 4 is the lcs which gives once 1 which is k over here n2 minus lcs so we have to do one insertions so the output of this question will be the number of deletions would be 4 and number of insertions would be 1 so this is the answer and for the, so this is very simple logic right the only main thing for you is to come with the logic that longest common subsequence is going to be applied in this question okay so once you have the lcs between str1 and str2 you can basically uh, solve many questions and a minimum insertion and deletions to transform a string into another is one of them and this common longest common subsequence comes handy in many of the questions and this is going this is very important for other interviews okay so now let's have a look at the code okay so in the code we are having uh, if uh, we are declaring a function transform and we it is accepting str2 str1 and str2 and we are calculating the length of the both strings n1 and n2 next we uh, call our get lcs length function which we have discussed uh, in the previous video and this is the same code of uh, getting the longest common subsequence and 
what we got is in return we got the lcs length over here and we just need to uh, uh, return the not return we just have to log the deletions and insertions that deletions is n1 minus lcs and insertion is n2 minus lcs that's all and the time complexity of this question would be same as the time complexity of this get lcs length function which is a uh, big O of n1 cross n2 n1 is the length of string 1 n2 is the length of string 2 and similar is the space complexity because we are creating a dp table fine so um, this was all in this video uh, see you in the next one